Hey everyone, it's Katie and welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be the furry friend tag part two. I say part two because I've already done this video of Skoda and everything. I did that with him maybe over the summer, so like July, August-ish, and I never did it with Cooper, or I think I filmed it, but I didn't like the footage, and I haven't got around to filming it yet. It just took a very long time to film it. I don't know why. I just never got around to filming it or anything. So I'm here with Cooper today, and we're going to film this video. You've probably seen Cooper in literally the background of 90% of my videos, maybe even 95 or 99% of my videos because he's literally in the background of every video. He always lays on my bed. He always hangs out with me. He's basically my buddy and I love him so much and everything like that. So I'm basically just going to be answering questions about Cooper today and everything like that. So let's just get right into it. And I will link the video that I did with Skoda down below. So the first question is, what is your pet's name? And this is Cooper. Meet Cooper, everybody. Say hello, Cooper. Say hello to the world. So number two says what kind of pet is it and what breed? If you couldn't already tell Cooper is a dog. I don't know if you could already tell. And Cooper is a boxer and everything. Okay number three says how long have you had your pet? Friend. So my family has had Cooper for four years because he just turned four years old in January. Number four is how did you get your pet? This is a easier, somewhat easier, somewhat more complicated story than Skoda's. So basically my family has had three boxers prior to Cooper. We've always had boxers. 95% of our dogs have been boxers. Skoda's our only dog that we've owned that was in a boxer and everything like that. Cause we love boxers. They're great dogs. They're pretty much family dogs, or at least most of them are. I'm not going to say all of them are because you never know. Like, it's just different with every dog and everything. But we've had mostly boxers. We love boxers. They're great dogs and everything like that. So Skoda, I think, was... I think Skoda was five or six when we got Cooper. And our last dog, Briscoe, had died, I think, a year before we got Cooper. We waited a good amount of time before we got Cooper. And we wanted Skoda to have a friend. Skoda was the only dog for a while. And then we got Cooper. So basically how we got Cooper is we got him through a breeder and everything, which I know some people don't like. But boxers have a lot of health issues. Most Briscoe had a lot of health issues. So we wanted to get a dog that we knew that was completely healthy. And the lady that we got him from, she like shows dogs and everything. I think Cooper was was supposed to be a show dog but the person that was going to be taking him couldn't take him so we got the call and we like said yes and we got um cooper i think from buffalo new york and everything i do live in new york if you didn't know that the lady that bred him is like a good breeder like she cares about the dogs and everything i'm not gonna like go too much into that but basically she like did did like things to make sure they're healthy dogs and stuff and cooper is healthy so far he's a pain but very very healthy. So that's basically how we got Cooper and I think we got him when he was 10, 12 weeks old. Number five is how old is your pet? I mentioned this, but Cooper is four years old. He turned four on January 11th. Like his birth date is January 11th, 2013. So Cooper is four years old and yeah, his birthday is January 11th. What is your favorite memory of your pet? I have so many memories of Cooper. I love how like when he was a puppy, he used to like tilt his head. So he used to go like this with his head and stuff like when um when he heard music or you had food he'd be like this and stuff it's super cute and when I was when I would wear my hair like up in a bun when I was like like when he was a puppy he would literally come up to me put his legs on my shoulders and get my bun out and like take the hair tie out of my hair and it was just so funny and I love how he just climbs up on my bed in the mornings he always wants to like barge in here he used to like knock down my door like knock it down get it open and come in here and jump up on my bed and everything and that was always cute um favorite memory of him though I'm not really sure I loved when he was a puppy and he was so small so he could fit into so he could fit into my lap and he's a 70 pound dog now so so that just doesn't really happen anymore he's not really a lap dog he tries to be sometimes but he's not he can't he's 70 pounds 
pets. He's a tank. Okay, so number seven says, what are some quirky things about your pet's personality? Cooper is literally a spitfire. Like Cooper is crazy. Cooper is just like wacky. He's honestly the craziest boxer slash dog we've ever had. I'll just name a couple things that are quirky about him. So the first thing is like an appearance thing that's quirky about Cooper. So as you can see, he's like, why are you holding my head? So like Cooper's ears like are kind of wonky looking. Like they're kind of like just random. And I, usually boxers ears like flat like that. Like how his ear is when I hold it down. They're supposed to lay flat and we try tried to get him to lay flat when he was a puppy, but we just failed at that. And so his ears just do whatever they want. They'll like go over there, they'll like go like that. They're just crazy ears and everything. So that's like one of his quirks. He does like the head thing, that's kind of quirky. And like if we're eating, he'll be like, come on, come on, I want your food. And if he wants attention, that's, this is a normal dog thing, but if he wants attention, he'll like be like, hey, hey, hey. I don't know, Cooper just, there's so much quirkiness about him that I can't like tell you at all because there's just so much. Well, yeah, his ears are probably the number one quirky thing because they're crazy and we love them. What does your relationship with your pet mean to you? It means everything. I love Cooper. I love him so much. Like I love just snuggling him. I love when he just lays in my bed. I love when he keeps me company. I just love like when I'm sitting down, he sits like right on top of me. And I'm like, yep, that's my boy. See, look at that crazy ear right now. I love like just how spunky he is, how crazy he is, how like weird he is. I just love Cooper so much and he means everything to me. Number nine, what are some of your favorite pastimes with your pet? walks, just chilling in the backyard. Um, when we take Cooper to the vet and he sees another dog, Cooper's just like, what is that? What is that? And we're like, Cooper, you can't play with every dog. He loves small dogs, he loves big dogs, and he just loves all dogs. Like he just wants to play with every dog he sees. And we're like, Cooper, you can't just play with every dog. Like you can't, like not at the vets at least. And I just love just like his crazy personality when he runs around and when he's just crazy, typical Cooper. So the last question says, what are your nicknames you call your pet? So Cooper likes Skoda has a a lot of nicknames. We call him a lot of things. So we call him Cooper, of course, but we also call him Coop and we also call him Dupe. So like Dupe, like, hey, Doopy. Doopy's another one. I, this is my, like what I call him. I'm like Duperella. So Duperella, Dupe and Arella, like Cinderella and Cooper together, but Duper. And I call him that because he acts like such a princess, like sometimes, like I'm on like, Cooper, can you get up so I can make the bed? And he won't get up. He's like, um, nope, I'm gonna lay here, I'm comfortable. And I'm like, really Coop? You act like such a princess and he just is and he's spoiled and he knows it. Coopy Doopies or Doopies, Mr. Cooper which I'm sure you know like about that. And actually my mom and I like sort of got the inspiration from his name from Cooper from Private Practice. My mom and I were like, yes. And most of our dogs are like named after Law and Order people like Briscoe from Law and Order, Skoda from Law and Order. And then one of our dogs was named after a basketball player. And yeah, so I think that's all of Cooper's nicknames. We have a lot of weird ones for him and stuff. And yeah, we mostly, I mostly call him him dupe. I like hardly ever call him Cooper. I only do sometimes. Usually it's either dupe or Cooper or Cooper dupe. So yeah, those are all the questions and everything. I hope you enjoyed me doing another one of these. And if you did, please give it a thumbs up and comment down below if you have a dog or cat or whatever pet you have. Comment down below like anything about them, an interesting fact about them, where did you get them? Just anything about your pet. Let me know their name. And just interesting facts about them. I would love to know. I love finding out about other people's pets. I love dogs. They are my favorite, but I love animals. I love finding out just interesting facts about other people's animals. I follow a lot of dog Instagrams. And by the way, Cooper and Skoda both have Instagrams of their own. Cooper's is Cooper Dupe Boxer and Skoda's is Skoda Boo Beagle. So definitely go follow them, especially if you want to see more of Cooper. I try to post on his Instagram story and I try to also post pictures of him every once in a while. So go follow 
follow him and yeah please subscribe if you haven't already because I post beauty and lifestyle and random kind of videos every single week I try to upload Monday Wednesday Friday or at least Mondays and Fridays at 8 a.m. Eastern Standard Time and also hit that bell down below to be notified because I know YouTube's glitchy and I think it's getting a little bit better but just if you want to be notified right when the video goes up definitely hit that bell down below just ring that bell and thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video bye this is your show today your time to shine yeah stay like that doopy Coop. this has been a lot of waited he is my puppy dog I love my Cooper <laughs> stop laying down okay fine Where's your cookie? Now every time I look at you, something is on my mind. If you do what I want you to, baby, we'd be so far.